action. Everything in life is marketing. Yep. I want the black brand to be one of the dopest brands on the planet. I want the black brand to be like Apple. Yeah. I want the black brand to be synonymous with luxury. Mm -hmm. The same way the Asian brand is synonymous with intellect. Right. The only way to have an excellent, luxurious brand is to be excellent and luxurious. (laughs) Absolutely. Holy Christ. I'm asking you to be excellent and luxurious. Am I doing something wrong? (laughs) No. To expect you to be Mm -mm. great. See, they even do that with the with the what do they call that rap? That's woke, like woke rap. Oh, uh, what is like that? Back, backpack rap or conscious rappers? Conscious rappers. So like that's that has its own label of like if you're a conscious rapper, that means you talking about shit that makes you think about some shit. That's so wild, right? The subgenre of rap <laughs> right, is to be conscious, sub-genre. and so I guess the main mainstream hip hop is to be unconscious. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't create. I didn't create it, right? right I, I didn't create right. that narrative. Yeah. They create that narrative, and so if I'm saying something positive, I'm being conscious, and if I'm just rapping just to rap, then I'm being unconscious. unconscious and yeah. and we have a whole. Uh, the whole world is listening to hip hop music, so I guess everyone is just unconscious. It's hippity 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 hop. Yes. <laughs> right. Mm-hmm. Then the next new jam. Is there any way that we can stop this epidemic? But as a black man, I can't say that hip hop music is destructive. Yeah, I mean, there's there's levels to it because on one hand, people can express themselves the way they want, and on the other hand, people should have their own accountability for what they consume. That's like how they got at Eminem for. I guess somebody, when he made Stan, that song Stan. Yes. And then the little boy committed suicide and they were, you know. That dude made some absolutely flagrant music. And he won like Grammy Awards for it. He did. And I guess it's because like you could see that he was acting. He was, he he made his hair blonde. Mm -hmm, He was mm -hmm. a caricature of the hip hop culture. And we allowed this guy to make fun of black folks. And he made millions of dollars. He made millions of dollars doing so. Yeah, still is. Yep. And so, like, I, I can't just put it on just race as a white guy. I'm looking mm-hmm. at all these performers who are being caricatures of what they're saying the black experience is. Yeah. And they're making millions of dollars pretending to be me. Absolutely. Be more intentional with your words. All you performers, I want to fight. What's up? Yeah, be intentional. That's very intentional. You mm-hmm. understand? Mm-hmm. Like, you you are destroying people's lives. You're making a profit. You are a poverty pimp. And no one will hold you accountable or take you to task. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because that's anti-black. You have a responsibility to behave. Now, being black means being excellent. It's luxurious. <laughs> and if you're doing anything to taint my brand, I want to fight you. What's up? <laughs> the greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive.